and the Germans had their neck down. And they ran out of ammunition. I can see the commanders are now panicking in the camp. They are calling, what are we going to do? Are you sure we don't have any bullets left? Are you sure there's nothing in the tankers? Are you sure we don't even have anything in the, ri in the rifles? What about our airborne machines? What about our ground force? Are you sure we don't have anything? The only things that they were left with was their uniforms and their empty guns. And the Germans were breathing on their necks. And they were not apologetic about it. Because it was a time of war. Let me tell you the devil is not going to say sorry. Because there is no better devil than the devil. The devil is on a mission. And his mission is to destroy you. Hallelujah. The devil is not going to negotiate. Because he is anointed to kill. He is anointed to destroy. He is anointed to devour. And he is going to breathe on your neck. And he is not going to let you go. And you are left with two things. To call for reinforcement. Surrender or die. But I've come this morning to tell you that this army is not going to surrender. This army is not going to retreat. We have been taught in our war. We are only taught one drum beat. It was in the days of Napoleon. A certain young man was taught to hit the drum for them. So the soldiers would go and the young man would hit the drum would hit the drum and the armies would go and go and fight and they would go and fight and they would destroy the other armies they would continue devouring going into the other armies camp but at a certain time and situation things were not as usual things were not as they were used to napoleon's army was losing he saw he was losing men in numbers Men were falling like flies. And Napoleon, one of, the, one of the commanders of Napoleon said, Young man, can you play the retreat drum? And the young man said, I know not how to play the retreat drum. Because they taught me to play the attack drum. Hallelujah. And this morning, we know not how to play the retreat drum. Because we are told that we are more than conquerors. We are told that the devil is under our feet. And this morning I want to tell you. This army will not retreat. Even if it means we are going to call for reinforcement. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed be his holy name. Amen. Praise God. Pastor Lowen. I want to preach my message. You see, this church will stop me from preaching. Yeah. Amen. God bless you. It's wonderful. The Americans were pinned down. There is nothing left. Everybody is in a panic. Even if you were hungry, you would be full at that time. Even if you were thinking of something, you would stop thinking about that at that time. Because death is breathing in. You can hear the tankers of the German ammunition drawing close. You can hear the sound of the airborne machines of the Germans drawing closer. And they are pressing them in a valley. So there is no way out. There is no way they are going to be saved. So it's either they have to surrender or they have to call for reinforcement. And one of those young soldiers realized he had a little mascot, a little pigeon with him. And then he remembered that this pigeon is a home-loving bird. If I can tie a message to him and he can survive the German ammunition, if he can get to the headquarters, we could be saved. Then they took a note and they wrote a note pinned in 